All right, these are the five skills you need to turn your CSV export into an Excel spreadsheet like this one behind me. The first one is understanding that Excel has layers. We're going to be getting our data out of the cell grid, which is the furthest layer back, and we're going to be putting it into charts, text boxes, and a fun layout. That means we're going to start thinking about Excel a little more like PowerPoint so that we can start doing more complex designs. But all the pretty designs in the world won't matter unless you have number two, which is clean data. What we mean by that is data with a single header, columns with consistent values. So I'm getting my file using Alteryx, which makes it really easy to combine two, 20, or even 200 different data sources, exports, etc. Blend them all together, clean them up, and give you a nice clean export that you can actually use to start building your report instead of wasting all your time on the boring data cleanup and data blending stuff. Next, we've got pivot tables. This is the single most valuable skill you can learn in Excel. There's millions of free tutorials, no exaggeration. And what we can do is use pivot tables to answer questions about our data, like how many sales we're getting each month this year, or how many sales we had this year versus last year. And we visualize these using pivot charts. We use those pivot tables to power these pivot charts so that when we add more data, it dynamically flows through to the charts. We don't have to manually update them every time. And last but not least is shapes, images, and text features. The interface here for editing these looks exactly the same in Excel as it does in PowerPoint. So start using those PowerPoint skills right here in Excel. All right, that's it, everyone. Thanks so much for tuning in. Have a good one. Bye.